Hello everybody and welcome to the what Orange Pool Studios. In this video, we're going to be showing you how to warp a text into shape. Warp text into shape with the Adobe Illustrator. You you eat however you want to eat. You 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 do whatever you want to do, right? And you don't know what you want. I've got my lips to an in a circle. Let's just change the color to so it can be visible and. With the pen tool, I'm going to make a, a curvy, swirly, a curvy type of shape going across the middle of the circle. And then just finish off the shape. Now we're going to select our curved line and our circle. We're going to punch out the top from the bottom. Well, no, so we're going to click intersect. So we remain with both our shapes. And then we're just going to type some text in any font you want to use. But I'm going to use, <coughs> let me see. That's a good font to use. I'm going to use Mollot. I'm just going to type orange peel. use anything you want to use. So I've just got my logo just to color pick. So we're just making our text bigger so to be sure we could fill. Send our text behind the shape. And we're going to go to envelope distort. Make with top object. Envelope distort make with top object. I just want to tilt them a little. Envelope the store, make with top. Okay, no. So we're getting this error because we bought them in front just to keep them behind. And we go back down, envelope the store, make with top objects. And you could leave it like this, or you could style it a little bit. I'm just going to put some style into it. Turn that to back. Just going to make sure it only fits the round circle. Just resizing it. And any every, everybody watching this, I want you to be on the lookout for the Orange Pill Studios new uh, logo design course, which is coming out. You will learn all you need to know about logo design and designing logos in Adobe Illustrator. Anyway, getting back to it. So I've created an offset path on the circle we created around our logo. And I'm creating another one and changing that orange, just to give it a little bit of style, just as a, rather than having the two words just there alone, just give it a little bit of style. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna, let's cut in half and we'll turn the bottom half of the of the outer circle, the outline circle, we're also going to turn that to the dark orange of the word peel. So, okay, there we have it. So we're going to send it to back and we're going to select the back and we're going to change that to peel. And there you have a simple 
um, what what text logo that could go on a t-shirt, could go on a mug, could go on packaging, could go everywhere. So I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and keep on the lookout for our new logo design course and our also our how to become an ultimate logo designer book that will be being released with the course.